Hi and welcome to another Philip in the video. <coughs> My voice is a bit croaky today. <laughs> and her in the background is laughing her head off. As you can see, I have recently He's designed <laughs> and I designed this in Tinkercad. I had to skate down a bit just to reduce printing time down to three hours and fifty minutes. Yes I did. Yes I did. <laughs> I did, I did make this for my tools, but I will be using it for something totally different. You can create these yourself in Tinkercad. Just go online, search tinkercad.com and go straight there, sign up and create your own account. I did 10% uh, infill, 2 perimeters, or 3 perimeter, 2 to 3 perimeters, and 3 top layers and 3 bottom layers. As you can see, that <coughs> I've sorted out my bottom layer which is nice and perfectly flat now. The secret is get yourself some metal feel feeler gauges. Make sure you've got the right uh, feeler gauge height on this one. This goes from 0 0.05 to 0 0.80 millimeters and I set it to 20 as it's instructed. But I can go down to 15 if I want a closer layer height. As you're doing it, you shove one of these underneath and if you can have a little bit of a noise from the Z motor, just raise it up very slightly until the noise stops. And there you go, you've got your Z height perfectly calibrated via metal. Don't use paper anymore as it's inaccurate because it squashes the paper. Well here we are in the bathroom where I recently printed these, this toothbrush holder of mine. I used Tinker Card, just the same, and it's getting a bit old now. And it's time to replace it with the new improved Lego One Block toothbrush holder, <laughs> which I recently told you in the first part of the video that I designed. I'll just put it there, and then we stick our toothbrushes in. But you can also use these, use this for anything you want: tools, toothbrushes, keeping bits and bobs in. Just scale it up and down as big as you like. Hope you like this YouTube video to show you what. 3D printers are capable of. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button and don't forget, ring, don't forget to ring that bell. Ding ring ding. Thanks for watching. Hi and welcome back to my video. Hope you liked the YouTube video of uh, 3D printed Lego one block. Stay subscribed and you'll see out for looking out for more stuff to happen. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs>